When I started cosplay, I'm really a very shy person. Well, really up to now. We'd like to, of course, uh, without further ado, let's introduce our panelists today, our star cosplayers here at APCC. First of all, let's introduce the one and only Elodia Gosofia! And uh, let's talk about some cosplay. Okay, let's start with uh, Alodia. Alright. Hi guys, I'm Alodia. <laughs> um, if you guys were like early in the community, you might know me as Black Mage. And there's also um, other inexpensive ways of achieving, you know, armored look. We're just a giant community for people who may have not been like the most popular kids in high school or middle school or whatever and uh, just no one really understood what you were into like but uh, you come here and you meet all these people who have the same interests and the same like they just have the same vibe for he I mean here in North America and elsewhere um, actually Hayden just mentioned most of it. It's more of the community, the bonding, because we all have the same, almost the same passions. I mean, whether it's gaming or anime, but we like creating things from scratch. And that's how we relate. And what's really nice about it is cosplay kind of breaks barriers. So it's not just limited to like when you're in the Philippines. It's like when you go to different countries, you meet someone there. Even if you don't even speak the same language, you can understand that. each other, which is pretty cool. And um, I also like that we also exchange tips and whatnot. Like for example, how to make things. So it's like a never-ending journey of learning. What do you think the future has in store for cosplay? Do you think in the future all of these people will be in cosplay costumes? I think that the way that cosplay has been embraced and celebrated in recent years has been opening up opportunities uh, apart from traveling as a cosplay guest. I've known some cosplayers who have gone to work for the costume department of Marvel and other movies like that. I think apart from that, the future is kind of already happening. Where Cosplay can be more than just a hobby. I know some of my friends have gone to work for uh, stage productions and production design. Uh, that really gives me hope that apart from being this hobby that brings us together and provides us all this fun and friendship that it could actually be something that changes someone's life and that they can turn into a career and build a life from. I'm really shocked about Philippines cosplayers' quality. It's really sharp. How can I judge them? <laughs> They're way more better than me. Uh, I do have a different career, which is I usually just keep kind of secret. Um, <laughs> superhero by day, cosplayer by night. <laughs> okay, our last question from the audience. Um, hi. 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 Um, my name is Paola Papanas. And my question, this is based on the research paper I did. Um, Alodia, I would like to ask, um, what benefits do you attain from your yourself doing cosplaying? Specifically, um, internally, like intrapersonally. Alright, um, when I started cosplay, I'm really a very shy person. Well, really up to now. I mean, it's very hard for me to go up on stage or to speak in front of a lot of people. So for me, cosplay was able to help me with that. Because for some reason, when I started, it acted like a mask. I mean, when I go up on stage, I'm a different character. So it's like, okay, I'm psyching myself up and people won't judge me or something. <laughs> well, I get judged but for my cosplay, but yeah. Um, after a while, like doing that for many years, it kind of helped me with my self-confidence, I guess. Like, little by little, I got to enjoy what I was doing. Like, bringing smiles to other people's faces. Because, of course, like, when someone cosplays a character you really love, it's like, wow, fandom. 
and yeah, I guess cosplay has done a lot for me and it helped me become a better person. <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. We'd like to thank everyone for coming and of course our special guest. Thank you very much. Winter Soldier is coming.